is Yorkshire guitarist Dan Carson. Hey guys, this is Yorkshire guitarist Dan Carson and I'm back with another Elite Bata reaction video. Today it will be to his rendition of Another Day by Dream Theatre. Now I know this song is one of the more mellow Dream Theatre songs, so yeah, it will be interesting to hear his take on this. Let's go. So here we go then. To be honest, I've not actually listened to this song all that much. I do love Dream Theatre and I'm liking this version. The song sounds to be in C sharp minor. Oh, I think it's A flat. No, it's A flat minor. So I'm watching this with a fresh set of eyes and a fresh set of ears I'm guessing because again I've not listened to this Dream Theatre track that much. I've heard it's good, I know there's a great solo in it and it'll be good to see how he approaches it. I like, that, I like the tapped harmonics that he just did. That's cool. Like the voicing he gets when he taps like the front of the fretboard when he taps the headstock strings. Like how he gets all these layered tones and voicings from the chords and arpeggios. I've noticed, of course, on his previous videos. I've also noticed, like with his finger picking style, how he's got uh, quite a long thumbnail. Look at things like likely a little bit of, you know, finger style too, but nothing like this. Not even close. If you wanted to get into the finger style stuff, a good tip right off the bat is, you see, grow the fingers on your right hand out a little bit, especially on the thumb, because you do use that quite a bit on the lower strings. Okay. So I'm guessing this is where things get a little heavier. Yeah, this is the solo. I've heard a lot of people on TikTok and Instagram do like a one minute video of the solo. It's definitely, I think, a lot of metal guitarists, including myself, do. Well, look at that. Well, just skip that back a bit. I saw him do something really technical. I just want to watch that again. This part here. Whoa! Whoa! Those sector plus there. Proper blows my mind when he does that. He kind of did it again there. Let's see if he does another one. So some more faster sequences there. Some good fast sequence of notes. 
that sound like they're being alternate picked, but they're not. It's his finger style. I like this. there. I thought it was going to end with a bit of an imperfect cadence but hey that's great. That's phenomenal. So that was my reaction to Elite Bata's version of Another Day by Dream Theatre. Now I'd just like to say that I do listen to a few Dream Theatre songs. I do like the prog metal stuff. Um, I've not actually covered that many Dream Theatre songs. In fact, I've only covered a little small segment of Glasgow Kiss by uh, guitarist John Petrusi. Uh, but yeah, I did enjoy that video. I did enjoy the leaps approach of that song. And it was cool to see the thing like the prog, I guess, prog ballad transition to, um, to the finger style stuff. I really liked that thing he did with the set of it, how he made it sound like he was alternate picking, but he was actually using finger style, I thought that was a very creative approach, uh, very good choice of chords in there, and the way he just, you know, manipulates the voicings, covers the ground of the vocals, percussion, chords, and, and, like the bass line, just very impressive stuff. So yeah, that's my reaction and two cents on the video. I hope you enjoyed and yeah, in the meantime, um, I'll be working on original stuff of my own. I've actually got a bit of a prog metal song in the works. I've done a playthrough of it um, on my channel. It's called Carnival of Carnage. It's really heavy. I'll leave a link to a playthrough of it. And um, yeah, um, hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time.